Over the past few years, India has emerged as an international destination for healthcare. The prime advantage to the international patients is the cost saving with respect to medical consultancy or surgeries. An estimated 150,000 medical tourists visit India every year and the figure is rising by 15% annually. The Confederation of Indian Industry and McKenzie report suggest that medical tourism could fetch as much as 2 billion US dollars by 2012 compared to an estimated 333 million US dollars currently. Leading the pack is Apollo Group, the largest hospital group in India and the third largest in the world. India has a large pool of over half a million doctors. These doctors are product of top-rated medical education system in India. The highly selective and stringent admission procedures ensure that only the best brains make it to medical colleges, which are comparable with the best in the world. Dr. Devi Shetty, a human face, a tireless crusader to bring healthcare to common man and to the children of the world. Upon his arrival from the UK, Dr. Shetty set up Asia Heart Foundation, a non-profit organization in Kolkata. It was his association with Mother Teresa as her personal cardiac surgeon, where he observed first-hand charitable work, which set the direction for his ambition in healthcare. Later, Dr. Shetty founded state-of-the-art hospital Narayana Rudhyale, which means God's compassionate home in the southern Indian city of Bangalore. Like the doctors, the nursing staff and paramedics go through rigorous training from nursing and paramedic schools spread across India. These well-trained paramedics and nursing staff are recognized internationally for their skill, fluency in English language and, of course, care. Indian hospitals invoked technology to bring healthcare through telemedicine to people across the globe. Telemedicine is the delivery of medicine at a distance and refers to the use of communications and information technology for delivery of clinical care to the patients. As far as the application of robotic surgery is concerned, which is the latest development in surgical field, we, we have been able to apply it almost everything which is available in the West. So it's urological operations, cardiac operations, chest surgical operations, all these which can be done anywhere in the Western world are available at a much cheaper rate and with equal if not more success in our country. The government of India has introduced a medical visa which allows an overseas patient to stay in India to have his or her medical needs met. India's healthcare industry derives unflinching support from the vibrant pharmaceutical industry. Indian pharma industry is estimated to be worth 6 billion US dollars and is among the top three generic producers and top three API producers globally. The key strengths of the pharma market are strong manufacturing base, well-established network of laboratories, research and development infrastructure, highly trained pool of scientists and professionals, and world-class quality products. As healthcare will remain one of the most indispensable sectors of a person's life, India will continue to remain in the forefront in offering healthcare to the world population. It will continue to heal the world with same care and warmth that has been India's centuries-old tradition.